What's going on you guys? So I have another Dell Latitude 7480. It's gonna be upgrades. So this has got a Intel Core i7 7th gen. I'm gonna turn it on and show you guys. It's got a eight gigs of RAM total and 256 uh, solid state drive. So I'm gonna boot it up and look at it. It's got Windows 11. I installed Windows 11 Pro. Just the space, uh, 256 kind of low. And it's got 8 gigs of RAM. So it runs fine. So I'm gonna go and shut this off. So I'm gonna hold this wait. Switch to the back side. So you guys can look at the model number. Okay, so I'm gonna get a uh, so they have a different type of screwdrivers you guys you can buy and it works pretty well. This is the it's the Phillips head and the flat head, but it works perfectly fine. So yeah, it doesn't slip. Uh the one I'm gonna use is a little bit better. But this like a mini one is some some mini ones. See this one is actually slips, so it's not good. But the uh, Stanley, you're gonna if you guys are gonna buy it online, they sell it on Amazon. Uh, you're gonna use this one, the biggest one, the Phillips head, and it works perfectly fine. I'll put a link in the description. You guys can buy it. So, and it's the model. So first of all, we'll do is got a three screws here in the left, two in the middle, and three in the right. So I'm gonna start from the bottom. In the right side, Okay, so what you're gonna do is, so you're gonna take this, the back cover, gently. And you're gonna lift it up like this. And it should come out. I'm gonna get a little brush and brush off maybe this little bit of dust. Same with the fan. Looks pretty clean. So guys, before you're gonna do that, uh, you're gonna there's a here's a battery, and you're gonna disconnect the battery before you're gonna do any upgrades. Right here, she's a connector. So you're gonna plug it like that. Plug it. Now what I'll do is. It's got a uh, eight gigs of RAM, but I'm gonna upgrade to uh, 32 gigs of RAM. That's 16 gigs per each stick. And this is a uh, dim slot A. This is dim slot B. So you're gonna install the first one here. DDR4, I'll put a link in the description. You guys can buy the, buy the RAM online. 
This is a match player. And it's gonna be an SSD and uh, also upgrade. So the one I'm gonna be using, uh, the Samsung I use is like the best. I like Samsung. Or if you want something better, you can just use a Samsung, the Evo Plus, the one terabyte. It's actually pretty good if you want to spend more money. And you only can install one way. This one back. And when I connect the battery, the connector back to the motherboard, don't forget. Connect, connected. Now, so what you're gonna do is, This have to be a line. See right here the line? Because it's not a line. You see that sticking out? Now it's a line. You see that jelly from the bottom right here? And now it's a line. So don't forget, make sure it's a line right here. See the line? Straight. I'm gonna put it back and Going back to the left side. I'm going to double check. So what I'll do is I'm going to turn it on. But I still have to reinstall the windows on it. Windows 11 clean install I'll do. I have to make a separate video. You just have to wait a few seconds. And now you're just going to get a message saying that uh, alert mild system memory has changed. You don't have to just click F1 
that's it. But uh, but you still have to read if you're doing a uh, clean install. Uh, I'll go with Windows 11 Pro, but if you like, you just go Windows 10. Yeah, it's got the Win uh, Windows Pro 11 I'm using, 64 bit. So guys, it's the end of the video. Let me shut this off. Thanks for watching. Bye.